What is up guys, welcome back to a brand new video, welcome if you're new. Before we start today's video off, I have a very special request from you guys. So, if you're new to my channel or if you've seen 5, 10 of my videos and you haven't already, please hit that subscribe button if you're a scooter rider or you enjoy scooter content. Scooter riders always talk about supporting rider owned businesses. That being said, why not support riders that are trying to make a business or a career out of their riding? So it would be greatly appreciated if you could hit the subscribe button. I've been working extremely hard to maintain this channel on top of work, school, and just life. So if I was actually able to make it a job for myself, it would be a lot easier to keep putting out these videos for you guys. Like I was saying, subscribing and liking this video will really help me grow my channel. And if I can make a career or a job out of scootering, then I'll have the time to keep putting out videos for you guys. So today we are at my middle school. This is a park that I haven't been to in a few years. And I definitely haven't rode here in even more years. It's not far from my house and I grew up riding here. Have so many memories in this park. Summer, winter, just riding with the homies. I'll give you guys a little bit of a tour of what spots are over here. So my favorite part about this whole spot is this tiny little ledge right here. This ledge was always a bit of a problem for me because I'm used to coming at it this way and this wall is right here. It's a brick wall kind of messing up your landing. It's like an 11 stair back there that I've never hit. There's like a small mani pad kind of thing over here and then a four stair in the back and then pretty nice flat ground space over here it's sort of slightly downhill going that way towards the basketball courts so it might be a good spot to learn fakie tricks or manuals just so you can keep up that momentum and there's also a little bench over there i don't know if you can see it so for now i just got here so i'm going to do some warm-up tricks off camera then do some warm-up tricks on camera and then we'll get into today's session actually i'm gonna stretch before i ride and i'm gonna record myself doing that because that's something i want to promote not enough riders even skateboarders bmxers not enough people stretch before or after they ride and it can help you avoid some serious injuries so let's do a little bit of a stretch Now that we warmed up a little bit on flat, let's set up the tripod by this ledge. Let's see, I think we can do this angle for now. I just spent a million years trying to get a good back 50 heel and then front 50 whip, mainly for Instagram, maybe YouTube shorts, definitely TikTok. Sometimes I do that in the middle of filming for a YouTube video. I'll just kind of stop and think of a clip or two that'll be good for Instagram reels or TikTok or something like that and just take like 10 minutes to really figure that trick out. Another thing that I never realized is how good this ledge will be at helping me get my 50s better. It'll definitely help me practice, get my 50-50 skills up. Oh. Ow.
thank you so much for watching today's video sorry if those last clips looked a little bit different i had to switch from my gopro to my phone because both my gopro batteries died as i said earlier it would mean the world to me if you could subscribe to my channel like this video leave a comment it really helped me out like i said if you guys need any scooter parts at all shop crypticprosscooters.com link to their website is in my description you can use code jake to save you 10 percent off of your order thank you guys so much for watching and i'll catch you in the next one